Uh, so Eric Paulson was really the first ambassador that RevGear's ever had, and he's been, well, he's been our best ambassador for 25 years. So over the years, Eric and I became great friends, and we always employed the same process when we went to develop products. The reason I found Paul and stuck with Paul at RevGear is because, first of all, he's an honest guy and he's open. So every time he would come out to see me, I would have new ideas or new products that I would like him to create. Eric would usually come to me with a concept that he liked, but something wasn't right. Uh, the quality wasn't right, it didn't fit right, um, or didn't have the right purpose. This Motion Master was created with a head on each end, which is based on the Infinity emblem, and it allows you to do circles and go halfway or all the way around. This is a smaller version of the Motion Master, um, which is helpful for this video. So this bag is identical to the big bag, except it's just a smaller version. When Eric came to me with this product, uh, I don't know, it's at least 20 years ago now, um, he had a lot of problems with the product that was being made. He had, he had invented a concept, it couldn't be made reliably, um, the seams were splitting, the, the foam was coming out, um, it didn't have the right shape. And so Eric and I went to work to figure out how we're going to make this product better. And he would give me a prototype and I go, no, that's not right. Or no, it feels off. And what, what he would do is he would ask me how to fix it and make it better. And he would send it back and get it back. He goes, how about this? I go, oh, it's still a little off or a little tight or this is, and he would send it back until it was perfect. We always um, approached a product uh, with the direction that we were going to make, we were going to com probably combine some concepts that may have existed, uh, but also make the product so many times better. We had to change the position of, well in this case he calls them the nubs, but we had to change the position of this, of these, to make sure they'd come out at the, at the, at the correct angle. The nubs, they're so you can get under, so it's not on the ground, so you can get your knees and your arms under these. These have pads, little pads in them, and I had on each end so you consistently are moving and hitting the whole time. And we had to change the fabric because um, a lot of the fabric we were using or was being used at the time wasn't holding up. So it's a Cordura covering. It's easy to wash. There's a zipper at one end if you need to pull stuffing out or put more in. Uh, it doesn't absorb too much moisture. But the material in this bag makes this bag outstanding because it's extremely strong and resilient. Overall, just the product was uh, something that no one had ever seen before, it was different, and also had uh, a high level of quality. So I'm proud of this, I'm very proud of this product, but I'm most proud that it's got Eric's name on it, and it has a Rev Gear label, and if you don't see this right here on the product you're getting, then you know it's not authentic. You could, you could get a bottle and you could practice feeding the, like you're holding a baby. It also works uh, if you want to like practice your air guitar.